Oh, you're here. Hello. I hope that um, the atmosphere is to your liking. I am really, really sorry about the inconvenience that I, well, caused by setting up the meeting at this hour. But in our last meeting, you did mention that um, you preferred darker spaces and all. Because they seem more... What's the word? Cozy? Please, have a seat. It's better to feel more relaxed when you talk to me about your problems. If the darkness bothers you, then I can turn on the lights for you. I tried to make sure that it wasn't super dark, but just enough for you to be able to see and navigate the area. Well, now that everything has been explained or whatever, do you want to continue off from our last meeting or... Oh, alright. I'll be here listening. Yes, sure, having a hard time to come up with your words. That's alright. I can help you with a few questions if you don't mind. Alright, let me just... You mentioned to me that um, you struggled with depression often. And I want to know, now that you've started these sessions, does it help in the slightest? Talking things out? Maybe getting some sort of idea of what you could do to improve your lifestyle, perhaps? I appreciate you being honest with me. No, I don't take offense to it. I know that this sort of thing might not always work immediately for people. Even if you have been here for a short while with me. I didn't expect to see too much progress or any progress at all. There can be people who can't feel like they're doing anything even when they have therapy. It's understandable. I would say that uh, you have to give it time, but... Even I can't guarantee that. Therapy is not for everyone. It's just a means to know what you might want and what could help you in the future. A lot of people like to talk things out and they think that because of that they should be able to solve their problems. And that is com commendable, honestly. But for the people that can't Exactly. Well, you know, like you. They don't know if therapy is going to work for them. And if it doesn't seem like it's doing anything, even at the beginning, they will start to lose hope. But I'm asking you, please, don't lose hope yet. Therapy is a long process. A very, very tedious process as well but as long as that you keep coming here i know that you haven't given up completely i know that you still want help and that's one of the greatest things that you can come up with wanting help is something that tells you that you haven't lost hope yet i'm glad that you haven't lost hope <laughs> You're about to. It's okay. It's really alright. There will be moments of weakness for you. And I understand that trying to seek for help while it's not working can be really tedious and draining. But I'm proud of you that you've been trying this hard already. You're doing good. 
think I'm talking a bit too much about the benefits or the drawbacks of therapy. We shouldn't be doing that now. So, tell me, now that you think that this might not be helping you, what do you think you might do next? Are you going to keep coming back? You don't know. That is fine. That is completely alright. You seem tense. Did something happen before you came here? You know, you can tell me everything. Everything that you say is confidential here. <laughs> You're still doubting it. It's okay. I know that finding trust is can can be hard. And I'm grateful that you told me everything that you already have. I'm not going to force you to tell me what happened, but... Alright, you're going to spill the beans anyway. Go ahead. I see. Everything is suffocating for you. A constant repeat over and over. Feeling hopeless of the situation. Not knowing what to do. What is the right answer? Surviving but not feeling alive in the slightest. How to understandable. Those feelings are normal. It's okay that you're feeling that way. I know that everyday mundane life can be quite a challenge on some people. Some people want more than what they have in life, and that's fine. You want things to get better, not having to go through the same pain over and over. And being able to be a better person out of it. <laughs> hey, call me breathing, okay? One, slowly. In and out. We don't want you panicked here, do we? It's going to be much harder for you to speak if you start to panic. Slowly and surely, you'll be alright. I'll say this now. I know that, well, this is a professional setting and all. But I have, well... Taken our liking to you, in a sense. <laughs> you look a bit confused. That's okay. I mean that I find you commendable and captivating. You're still here after so many sessions. Your life seems to be falling apart around you, yet... You still want to make things better. I mean, that's one of the many reasons that I stopped charging you for these sessions. I saw how you wanted to get out of that mental space. And being able to improve as a person as well. I know that our sessions only last around two hours or whatnot. Conversations that we do have are intriguing, to say the least. I think I should pause. Apologies. I brought some snacks for you as well. I knew that these well, situations are stressful. And I don't want you to feel too stressed out today. Here you go. Drink some water too. Take it easy. <laughs> you look like you haven't drank water in a while. Do you drink enough water? You need to drink more, okay? 
it's not good for you if you don't drink. You don't want to feel dehydrated all the time. And if that keeps happening, it'll be much harder for you to do the simple things, okay? So promise me, you'll try to at least drink more water. I want to hear you say it. There you go. Now, I know that this isn't something that I'm supposed to do, but it's just a suggestion. I know I give many suggestions on how you could improve your life and how you could stop feeling so, well, hopeless in times of crisis. But I have something that you might find desirable but if you don't then you're free to reject the thought and we can pretend that this conversation never happened I was thinking now that everything seems to well not go right for you work being too hard not being able to do the things that you want to do because of other commitments. Things falling apart around you even though you were trying your best to keep them together. Family and friends leaving for no apparent reason. Everything around you seems like it's collapsing. And you don't even want to bother trying. And that is alright. I know I keep saying that everything is alright. Because I want you to, well, sorry, it's just a bit um, hard saying it. It's, how about? You come and live with me. You seem so confused. It's okay. I should have clarified a bit more. Apologies. I was saying, why don't you come live with me so I can take care of all the things that you don't want to take care of. You won't have to feel worthless all the time because I'll keep on reminding you how you're not. I'll keep trying my hardest to make you feel loved and appreciated and cared for. I'll try my very best to make everything okay for you. Even if it's going to take us a while. And you won't have to bother with anything that might trouble you. Because it'll be far into the past. Anyone that can, well, hurt you won't be able to do that anymore. And when you feel your worst, I'll be there right beside you to help you up. You won't have to go through anything alone. You tell me how lonely you feel constantly. And I don't want you to keep feeling like that. I want you to feel like there's someone next to you, caring for you, loving you exactly how you would want to be loved. I know how much you want someone to just do everything for you, everything that you don't want to do. The day that you told me that you wanted someone to take you away, so every other worry that you had in the past would just fade away, and you wouldn't have to ever think about it again. Letting that person take care of it, and when I heard that, that was when I knew that I could provide that for you. And of course, 
very serious about this. If you so desire, I can make that happen. I already took a really high fondness to you. And I can't help it. But be that fond of you. Every char characteristic of you is beautiful in my eyes. Even if all you tell me is about your struggles, I still can't help it but see the beauty in you. <laughs> it's okay if you don't know what to say. I probably overwhelmed with all this information. It's okay. Just take your time processing it and let me know your answer, okay? I don't mind any. You can reject it. You can accept. Well, of course I want you to accept. Like I said, I'm really fond of you. Might I say I quite love you. I can make all of your worries go away. Oh. You don't need to start crying, but it's okay. Come here. You can hug it out. I'm here for you. I'm here to listen to any and all worries you have. Things are just are okay. <laughs> Let your tears out. Just fine. Now, are you feeling a little bit better? Even it's a, even if it's a tiny bit. All right. I'm glad that you're feeling a little bit better. You came here feeling so overwhelmed, but I'm glad that you opened your heart out to me to tell me. What has been bothering you? It takes a lot of courage to do that. Thank you for doing that. And thank you for telling me everything that you already have. I really appreciate it. Look, I'll... Since you accepted my offer... You can't go back on it. Oh, you understand. Well, I was thinking of a little something. Here. It's another glass of water. Please, drink this if you want to. Completely accept you staying with me so I can take care of you. And you don't have to live a hard life anymore. You won't have any worries. None at all. I'll be taking care of every single one of them. What do you say? Do you accept?
I'm glad. Lay down a bit back on your chair. You might feel a bit dizzy. It's fine. This is not going to hurt you. It's only going to make you feel calm. And when you wake up, I'll be here for you. Right beside you. For as long as you live, you won't have any other worry ever. And I'm glad that you decided to go with this. Now close your eyes. I'll hold your hand if you feel a bit scared. There you go. Sweet dreams, okay? Sweet dreams. <laughs>